Chapter 6, Playtime Land. On his way home, Pinocchio meets a bird. The bird asks, Are you Pinocchio? Pinocchio says, Yes, how do you know my name? The bird says he knows all about Pinocchio. He knows the blue fairy is gone because her little brother never came home. He also knows Geppetto is going across the sea to look for the little puppet. Pinocchio is worried about Geppetto. He tells the bird, I must find my father. The bird says, Get on my back. I will help you find him. Pinocchio rides on the bird. They fly to the sea. They fly to an island. The blue fairy lives there. They are both happy to see each other. Pinocchio lives with her and promises to be good. He even starts school. At school, he meets a boy named Lampwick. Lampwick doesn't like to study. One day, he tells Pinocchio about Playtime Land. Lampwick says, I am going there tonight. Nobody studies there. Every day is a vacation. Do you want to come? Pinocchio thinks it sounds wonderful. A donkey cart arrives, and both boys get in. In Playtime Land, Pinocchio and Lampwick enjoy themselves. They meet lots of other boys, and they play all day. Pinocchio says, What a beautiful life! See, I was right, says Lampwick. Then one day, Lampwick wakes up with donkey ears. Pinocchio has them too. A mouse tells them, You have donkey fever. All boys who only play and never study turn into donkeys. A few minutes later, both boys turn into donkeys. Chapter 7 The Whale The man from the donkey cart comes. He sees that the two boys are now donkeys. He takes them to town and sells them. The man sells one donkey to a farmer. That donkey is Lampwick. He sells the other donkey to a man who makes drums. That donkey is Pinocchio. The drum maker wants to use the donkey's skin to make a drum. But first, he must kill the donkey. The man ties a rope onto Pinocchio and throws him into the sea. In the sea, many fish come. They begin to eat the donkey. 
They eat all the meat off. Only the puppet is left inside. Pinocchio swims away. But as he is swimming, a whale comes and swallows him. Inside the whale, it is very dark. Pinocchio sees a tiny light. He walks to the light and he finds his father. <laughs> Pinocchio says, Father, I found you! How long have you been here? Geppetto says, I have been here for two years. We must get out of here says Pinocchio. He takes his father by the hand. They walk up the whale's throat to its mouth. The whale is old, so it sleeps with its mouth open. Pinocchio and Geppetto climb over the whale's teeth and jump into the sea. Geppetto rides on the puppet's back as Pinocchio swims for land. Chapter 8 A Real Boy Pinocchio swims to land. His father is weak and tired. Pinocchio finds a house and goes inside. He does not see anyone, so he asks, Is anyone here? I am here, says a cricket. My dear cricket, says Pinocchio. The cricket says, Now I am your dear cricket? You try to hit me with a hammer. You are right, Cricket, Pinocchio says. You can send me away, but please let my father stay. The kind Cricket says, You can both stay. Pinocchio asks, Where did you get this nice house? The Cricket says, A blue fairy gave it to me. When will she come back? The puppet asks. Never, says the cricket. Pinocchio is sad to hear this. Pinocchio works hard to help his father. Every day, Pinocchio works for a farmer to get one glass of milk for his father. After some time, Pinocchio also learns to make baskets. He also studies reading and writing. Pinocchio studies at night and works all day. One day, Pinocchio goes to town to buy new clothes. On the way, he learns from a friend that the Blue Fairy is sick. Pinocchio gives four coins in his pocket to the friend. He says, Use these to help my fairy. In a few days, I will give you more. That night, Pinocchio has a dream about the fairy. When he wakes up, he is a real boy. Pinocchio looks around the house. It is also different. He and his father now live in a nice house, and they both have nice clothes. Geppetto tells Pinocchio, 
this is your reward. When boys try to be good, it changes everything. Pinocchio tells his father, How funny I was when I was a puppet! But how glad I am to be a real boy!